New donors have stepped up to help with the cost of the new Muskoka Lumber Community Center Library in Bracebridge. Coulson Brothers, Scow Service, Don and Joyce McKay, and Robert Jacob all contributed funds towards the various parts of the new library space. Bracebridge Mayor Rick Maloney says the community support for this project has been immeasurable. It is absolutely overwhelming. I know at this point, I think that we're probably almost three and a half million dollars worth of sponsorship for the Muskoka Lumber Community Center. Um, and that has uh, been, as I said, uh, primary sponsorship on uh, the building naming rights, but even goes down to dressing rooms, to water fountains, to, uh, you know, as we saw today, tutorial rooms and maker space rooms that, uh, uh, you know, really help every little bit of the community support that we've had helps significantly. And that is also includes uh, the uh, community support behind uh, the Buy a Bay uh, program where folks can, uh, uh, for a few hundred dollars, uh, sponsor a Bay of Books within the library. And also uh, the Best Seat in the House where, again, for a few hundred dollars, you can sponsor a seat with uh, a naming right of a plaque on a seat in the arena. So we're looking at every opportunity to bring this community uh, to rally behind this project. The community has shown that they have, and uh, we're very excited about that. And as for the progress on the build itself, Maloney says it's moving along well with a fall of 2024 ribbon cutting plant. Well, we've been very fortunate that the weather has really cooperated for the general contractor. Uh, I think that they're absolutely on target, if not maybe a few, uh, a week or two ahead of schedule in terms of timing. Uh, so that's important now, you know, it's important that uh, as we see the steel get up and, and the structure start to get closed in, the quicker they can do that, the quicker that uh, contractors can get in and do all the mechanical and wiring and all those necessary things that uh, can happen without the challenges of the elements of the winter.